Leeds. Leeds nil. Manchester United 2. Manchester United with another three points, baby. And this time it's the Rose Derby. Yes, after three points. After a tough match today. It was so damn hard. And then after 70th minute, Manchester United showed guts. Yes, they made it heaven for us on a Sunday. Can you believe it? We've shown them up. Yes, we scored two goals today. Not like the last time where we conceded two, go two goals and scored two goals. This time, we didn't concede a goal. We kept it clean. Sheet, yes, big up to Eric Ten Hag today. You would have thought he was on bush today. The smoking the, the some next high grades or something like that. You don't know, but like, you just thought he was on crack to put Maguire and Luke Shaw as center back. You boys be thinking, no, nah, you are mad. But today, Ten Hag was smoking the finest high grade, the finest cigar because he showed us that now nah, he knew what he was doing. Definitely, Manchester United did as well. Ooh, it was tough. Overall, in that first 45 minutes, guys, oh, so damn tough, you know. Match United were lucky. We were so lucky because we were shit, you know. We were just seeing glimpses of what was happening, what we saw on Wednesday, especially in that first half. We got lucky at times. Lees were unlucky to not score goals, opportunities, post this and that. Maguire as well, making mistakes, passing it to the opposition. You knew, like, was thinking, rah, Maguire, like, you're still doing the same fuckeries that you did before. In this game and you're given a chance but god look we was lucky to go nil nil at half time i was like i will take this any day because i was seeing that i was feeling in my head we could win one nil that first goal came in in the second half yes let's highlight sabitza sabitza oh what a wonderful long range pass to Lucas Shaw, Luke Shaw crossing it in and finding the head of Marcus Rashford to feed it in the back of the net, just like he's been feeding kids. He's feeding the nets, the opposition net. You get me, and you already know Marcus Rashford. It was just heaven, baby. And uh, again, the substitution that he made, Ten Hag, to bring on star boy Ganacho, Ganacho himself. Oh, 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 yes. Uh, you have to bring it up to work ho workhorse because workhorse be able to find Ganache to release him and Ganache or explosiveness just guiding galloping back in the back of the net. Yes, two 0 to Manchester United and we was like it's a wrap. It is a wrap right now, bro. We're gonna go home with these two points. Go back to Manchester. Get the head out of Leeds because we have won and we are just sitting two points behind. I mean, we're second for the first time in this season above man city temporarily but that just shows exactly the progress that ten hog has made big up to eric ten hog guys as always man but yes player wise today i fought fred he won man in the match he done well but at times he pissed me up he stressed me out but i thought you know what he got man in the match because it is his day it's sunday pastor fred only preaches well on a sunday at times and then sancho having that first start done well you know sometimes he did lose the ball but it's all about getting the minutes back into these legs. Bruno, yeah, he frustrated me throughout the whole 90 minutes. I'm seeing that Bruno that I saw in the past. Maguire, are you a shit? No, I don't gonna lie to you. I, I I know we won, but I think he just needs to be not in this team anymore. Rashford, as always, done what he had to do. Frustrating, but he got the goal. And yeah, and Gonacho as well, same as well. There was a glimpse of what we saw on Wednesdays, but again, he got the goal. Man of the match today has to go to Ralph Workhorst. I mean, Workhorst, whatever his name is. He was instrumental, especially in that second goal. He was getting himself in the bout. And then you saw that he dropped from sense, from striker position to playing in, in the hole, number 10, and just winning everything in the air. So he was he was good today, you know. This was the type of game that I saw what I needed to see. I know at times he's been poor. He's been shit. Don't get me wrong. He's been shit at times. And you're thinking, ugh, little dandy lag. Dandy Lang legs and everything just really just puts you off. But he did well. Donkey of the match has to go to our captain. All he can say is, I'm the captain of the club. You know, blah, 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 blah. Harry Maguire. You, you, you just a joke, man. Anyway, guys, this has been your match reaction from your boy, Ivor and Spice as well. Let me know who your man the match is, who your donkey of the match is. And let me know your thoughts in the comments of this game as well. Remember to catch us tomorrow live, Instagram TV, the catch up volume 91 or 92 whatever it is at 8 p.m uk time to discuss and review this game but it is what it is guys as always remember to keep it united and remember to keep it ready united your boy is out peace